We built technology in Modern Animal to really move this industry forward. We started with the belief that technology was incredibly powerful as a tool to drive more meaningful conversation and connection between a veterinarian and a pet owner. It's becoming quite obvious to a lot of people, not just us at Modern Animal, that AI in healthcare applications can do a lot to meaningfully automate and remove and facilitate more efficiency in terms of how a doctor goes about their day. One of the reasons I think that exploration of AI as a technology that can be impactful in veterinary medicine is so important is that we've undertaken this idea that we can make veterinary medicine a more sustainable profession for the people who show up every day on the front lines and do the work. Everything that we look at from how we have medical operations to how we practice medicine to what our consumer experience is, for all those things, we look at them and think, is there a technology lever that we can pull to better enable the experience? I spent a lot of time in clinic trying to talk to doctors and understand what are the areas that technology can do this part for them. What can technology take over for the doctor that they don't have to do? How can we make it easier, more efficient, simpler? We learned that our doctors we're spending a lot of time writing these summaries, not only for diagnostics, but the care summaries in general. They just had so much information that they wanted to portray to the members. We can actually very specifically tailor what is being added into the model and then what we want to get out of that and then format it in a way that fits with what the doctors actually want to see on their screen. Not only are we writing things shorthand in a medical, in medical terminology, medical jargon, that's not easy to understand, but we have to then digest that and put it into a member-friendly um, output. And that is challenging to be able to put in what I want in there and to have a more easily understood summary is, is just so helpful. One of the things that I really value about the way we've built AI is that it's truly there to be an assistant to us and to um, eliminate some of the busy work for our day. There's no part of these features that we've built that are designed to replace your pet's doctor's input in your pet's care. It's really been life-changing. Historically, I would spend probably anywhere between three to five hours um, a day writing care summaries. I can get through you know, our care summaries and, and those write-ups in a much, much quicker. And then I can really get time back in the appointments to do that what I love, to do that face-to-face -face, uh, interaction with people. And also at the end of the day, I get to go home and I get to sit with my family and really get some lifetime back. It's interesting when people think about how AI might dehumanize us, right? Like actually take the human out of the equation. If AI becomes a tool that we can use in a collaborative fashion that actually helps our doctors be more efficient at their day, helps them get to the right answer for their patients, and then ultimately spend less time with the computer and more time with the humans in the equation and the pets that they you know, so desperately want to make better, then that's, that's the win, right? My hope is that everyone takes this opportunity to really think critically about how they apply technology in their own practices. And if they do, we'll be a much better profession and better industry for it.